he couldn't let, but I doubt, I'm just saying, Usher, like, he was talking soft to you, man. That's how he talked. <laughs> like, how, what, what did Usher say? You give me a line that Usher told him that just put him over the roof. You had, a, you had a whole bunch of funny stories, but one of the funny stories was the Chris Brown story. And fast forward, you see him wilding out on Usher, uh, uh, allegedly jumping Usher. What, what was your take on that when you seen that? It, it get glitchy sometimes, man. You know what I'm saying? You get, you, you get to mix it up off them cocktails, man. That, that shit get glitchy. You know what I'm saying? Look, the crazy part is they, they got a motherfucking uh, viral clip of him uh, scratching his nose in the club. I seen this. I seen I the mean, scratch. I see. Yeah, it was a scratch. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna look out for you, Breeze. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? He was scratching his nose in the club, <laughs> man. You know, see, he better slow down. And you know, like, it should never get to a point to where a nigga uh, fighting a nigga that legendary that threw your party in Vegas, your birthday party. It's like, man. Do we do we do we put envy? Do we do we add in envy on that shit or no? Or we just leave it on the drugs? Like which one is it? Yeah, what do you think it was, bro? I I mean, they say it was Tiana. I don't know, but at the end of the day, that shit can be talked out. That's Usher, man. And he ain't trying to do no fighting. So let me ask you then, because you know, nigga is on, you know, a little inebriated. Yeah. But also he, he claimed the set though. Do you think like maybe like just that pride of like nigga, this nigga talking to me crazy? I'm on set, I'm, you know, we got, we got to handle them. Uh, that's how he thinking all the time. You guys think he, he's a mad man because that's how he thinking all the time. But for sure, he couldn't let. But I doubt, I'm just saying, Usher, like, he was talking soft to you, man. That's how he talked. <laughs> like, how, what, what did Usher say? You give me a line that Usher told him that just put him over the roof. To where it was just like, nigga. No, nah, because, you, come on, you tripping, Chris. Yeah. yeah. Because it was like Michael Jackson. But you used to roll with Chris, so they were saying his partners beat him up, so you would have been in the entourage of the people that would have whooped his ass. I would so not would have you? whooped his ass. I ain't good, man. Hell no. Nah. you told I would have talked him out of that one. I would have talked him out of that one. Because it's like a lawsuit anyway. Like, you know what I'm saying? If he do, if he do go the police way, I mean, be happy that he, he treats you like a little brother and he, you ain't really fuck him up that bad. So he said it was, it was the people around him that did it? Yeah, it's his entourage. It's entourage I mean, what cookie point? I mean, you got to change the people around you <laughs> at that point, man. But he, he had to tell them to do it. Right. But you got to change the people that's around you at that point, man. You know what I'm saying? These niggas just packing Usher out. <laughs> like, yeah, I, was gonna, I, was just, lie. I was just going to ask you, what celebrity just gets a pass just because that you, you that's, that's... Drake. Drake. What Drake. is it that Drake has done? It seems like Drake is like, Drake everybody fucks with Drake. Because he don't bother nobody. That's crazy. Wait, now, and I ain't going to lie. I, I met Usher. Usher good like 5'3". Like, he, 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 he's small. That's what I'm trying to tell you. I met him too. We shot the video uh, with Kid Ink. Uh, uh, body language, man. You know what I'm saying? I, he's a very interesting person, man. You know what I'm saying? When it comes to someone being just smaller of stature, do you be like just giving the pass? Like, I don't care what kind of shit you talking to. You just... I, I mean, even... in that world, you know what I'm saying? You got to hold the belt for the toughest singer. <laughs> <laughs> so you know what I mean like as the toughest singer I don't know like all of them is Chris the only one and Jason Derulo them the, is the only niggas that, that reach over like 5'9 all the other singers Weekend and all that you know what I mean <laughs> Bobby Valentino's yeah. <laughs>